And now for a quick look at some of the stories from the world of arts and culture. Stay tuned for our News Roundup Shortcuts. Star Trek actor Anton Yelchin was killed in an accident at the weekend in his Los Angeles home. He was 27. Yelchin's car rolled backwards down his steep driveway, pinning him against a wall. The Russian-born actor had played Brainy Pavel Chekhov in the latest Star Trek movies. He will appear in Star Trek Beyond when it's released next month. The new film by Damien Chazelle will open the Venice Film Festival on August 31st. Chazelle also wrote and directed the award-winning Whiplash. His latest, La La Land, is a modern take on the musical. It stars Emma Stone as an actress and Ryle Gosling as a jazz pianist looking for love and fame in Hollywood. Christie's put some of the artworks it will put under the hammer this summer on display in London. Featured are British artists, including some of the greats, sculptor Henry Moore and painters J.M.W. Turner, Lucian Freud and Francis Bacon. The auction house is also celebrating its 250th anniversary this year. A painting that an Italian flea market dealer says is by Modigliani will go on display in Rome this month to provoke a debate about who made it. The painting called Odette is a portrait of a woman with a long neck and almond-shaped eyes. The dealer found it in 2006 leaning against a rubbish bin in Rome. He says it's a Modigliani. Experts are divided. Joseph Kossuth, a pioneer of conceptual art, has no plans to slow down at the age of 71. Famous for using words instead of visual imagery, Kossuth's works were exhibited at Art Basel last week, about 50 years after he burst onto the art scene. He says it's strange when a Wunderkind ages, but he's never been busier.